the relationship that Stratasys has with Optimac is a really fun venture of marrying two technologies together to actually bring smart tools and smart parts to life. So the Optimac uh, aerosol jet process is, is very in enabling. Um, one, one feature is that it has a very large standout distance, so, so we can print on, on surfaces that are, that are curved and, and have a very complex geometry. And that's because our, our print head section never touched the surface. They, they literally um, uh, create a jet of the, of the material, and it's a jet of material that gets jetted down onto the surface. It uh, really opens up uh, the possibilities of printing in three dimensions. We can print electronics onto it. You can give it intelligence, and that has not been done to date. And that's what's so exciting about marrying the two technologies together. These are both additive manufacturing technologies. You're only putting material where you need it. So there's not a lot of waste. So in the aerospace applications, it's really neat as well from my perspective. What we did there is that right now with the U.S. military, and even commercial applications for unmanned air vehicles or drones, when you start looking at the little helicopters or UAVs that are flying in airspace, they have wings. Now with the two technologies combined, we can actually print onto a wing of an airplane, an antenna, a power circuit. Well, the UAV project is, is really cool. One of the enabling features of the combined technologies is that now we can make um, UAVs that are much lighter with much more functionality than what's available now. And so the, the idea of uh, embedding the, the sensors and the, the electrical components into the structure, um, that removes a lot of the you know, standalone components that would, would be in, in, in the UAV otherwise.